I welcome you back into the channel. Thank you for everyone that has subscribed. Today I want to go into confessions. I had to go and see Rev Resale and confess what had recently happened. I never made it, but I know what it takes. I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading it slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing, go out of this world and ride on. What recently happened was I had a record ship out. You know, I'm a very busy mama. So I contacted Rev Resell and I asked him if I could sit down for a confession. And Rev happily said, began to tell him. So Rev, a week ago, I sent out a record. It was the wrong record. You know I'm a full-time mama and I'm very busy. And I noticed a week later that the wrong record had gone out after a person had purchased the second record, the record that I had sent to the wrong buyer. So I messaged the buyer and I said to the buyer, I sent the wrong record. If you could please send it back, that would be great. But then I erased what I said and I said to the buyer, you know what, go ahead and keep that record. If you like that record, you deserve that record. And I'm sorry that I sent the wrong record, but your correct record is on its way. So of course, Rev tells me, and it's just so nice to have somebody to confess to when you do things wrong. But it's okay guys, mistakes happen, we live and learn, and we learn from those. As Rev said to me, you did the right thing, and that's all that matters. So, I just want everybody to know that no matter what happens, just do the right thing that you feel in your heart, and then everything will be okay. I just wanted to come on here and share. Thought it'd be fun to add Rev into it. Rev was very gracious to send me the pictures to do this great video. And the customer got that record, got both records. The customer's happy. They said they would pay me for the difference. I said, no way, that's not what I wanted. Um, and I told the other buyer that had purchased that, sorry, I had misplaced this item. So it's a bummer for the second seller, but you know, I felt like I did the right thing on letting that person keep that record. If they enjoyed that record, they can keep that record. If you've ever done anything like this in your time of reselling, let me know down in the comments. I'd love to hear. Um, this is not the first time I've actually done this. The first time I ever did this, was I was selling on Poshmark and I sold a pair of Under Armour men's uh, boxer shorts and he ordered the 2X and I sent him the 3X one and he shipped it back to me and I sent him the correct one but I thought after that time I'd never do it again but obviously I was in a little bit too of much of a hurry like Rev told me just slow down take your time um, this is your business, so you want to treat your customers like you want to be treated. So I felt like that was fair to that buyer to let them keep that record. Thanks everybody for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell for new videos coming out. And I love interacting with you guys in the comments. I hope you all have a good rest of your day. This video was a lot of fun to make, and I hope it helps you all out. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye now. I want to give a big, huge thank you to Rev Resale and his wife, Nikki T, for giving me these pictures to do this great video. Y'all go over and check out Rev and Nikki T on Rev Resale. I'll put a link here. Mm -hmm.